Hey guys, Vizero here. So, I did not really know how I was going to title this video, how I was going to make this video, and I've done multiple takes of this video because I all did it in different perspectives, but I feel like now I should just really share what's going on. So, for the past six-ish months, I've been building up to a channel change where instead of me making gaming videos, I would make technology videos. And I, at the time, that was my passion. And it was just because all of a sudden, I was finally starting to, I guess, learn more about computers in general. And that got me into tech YouTubers, which got me into the idea of making tech videos. And as time went on, I began to build more and more towards that. You probably know that if you've been around for at least the past few months. And eventually, I just got sick of waiting, so I just start started to change because... I just felt like I might as well also build up to this because a sudden just switch like that would be terrible for my channel. And as I built up to that, not only did I lose subscribers, as in like my subscriber rate went down, my view weight, my view, my view weight, my view rate went down by a lot. And that was probably just because I had stopped engaging in my content. I was now making content for an audience that wanted something else. And as time and time went on, I just pretended that the problem would go away. But now, now I actually have the equipment to make those tech videos. And now I'm starting, for everyone who subscribed, for the amount of people, I don't know how many people subscribed for the tech videos. I know majority of people subscribed for the gaming videos. This solution is probably, what, I, what I've been thinking of is probably not going to sound too great to you, but... Now I've been having second thoughts. Now I've been feeling more, I guess, um, I've just been feeling more controversial. I've been feeling like there's a lot of conflict going on. Like in my head, I'm just like, man, do I do tech videos? Do I do game videos? Like it doesn't, I'm probably making it sound over dramatic, but being honest, like I was just like stressing out a lot over what am I going to do with this channel? And now and over like a few days like the last few days i've been just panicking because i didn't know what to do and just today i came up with a solution that i feel like benefits both sides so the first thing i have to mention is that i am now passionate about gaming videos game news videos again because i miss them i think i just needed a break for a while because if you take breaks and that can relieve you not feeling like I can relieve stress and it can also make you feel more passionate about something. But I didn't do that. I kept going and I wanted something else. And now I want I miss gaming videos, to be honest. And I want to make those just the exact same videos I used to make. And my plan is to keep making those because I I love those videos, being honest. I really like them still. And what I wanted to do was I basically my solution that I came up with today was this. Everyone who subscribed for my tech video is not going to like this, but basically, Vizola Productions, from here on out, for at least for the next six months, but I'm planning to do this for as long as Vizola Productions exists at this point, is that it's going to be solely a gaming news channel. There's not going to be anything related to technology at all. Well, what I mean by that is that those Apple, Samsung, smartphone, laptop, computer, all those type of videos... Are not going to happen on this channel they're not happening and instead this channel is going to be what it was in november october the channel where i make videos i'm passionate about in this industry and those videos i feel like i owe it to myself to make but i also owe it to my fan base because my fan base i hate using that word because fan base makes you sound like you're huge youtuber but in reality my i guess com community of around 800 people which is still amazing to me is i i owe it to you guys and it's just because i spent all this time building up this channel and then everyone and then the people just give in and they just subscribe to be notified and they help me build this channel and then i just switch it like that to something completely different i that looking back that was one of the worst decisions i could have made and now i like i said i think i owe it to myself and i owe it to my channel to and i owe it to everyone being honest 
to go back to that. Now, for everyone else who subscribed, the small amount of people who subscribed for technology content, don't unsubscribe yet. Uh, well, I mean, if you want, you can because it's going to be gaming news a gaming news channel. I've come up with a solution that benefits both sides. So, Zillow Productions will be solely a gaming channel. So, not gaming like gameplays. I'm talking about gaming news. What you guys subscribe for, that's you know, the majority of what you subscribe for is going to be on this channel. And that's strictly gaming news content. Nothing else. For Twitch, that's going to be where I'm going to hold my gameplays, my live events, which is in the description of all my new videos going forward now, including this one. That's going to be for all that. And for technology. I'm still passionate about technology. It's just that I need to get Vizilla Productions working again because I'm also passionate about that content, the content I would be making here. So I've made a new channel, and this new channel is not going to replace this channel. It's going to live side by side, just just like that not, they're not going to be competing with each other it's not going to be one has more priority of the other one is they're both 50 50 and one is going to be a tech channel and the other is going to be this channel so this tech channel is going to be solely solely 100 percent strictly technology videos and i think this is the best of both worlds for, well i think it's the best of both worlds because the people who want the tech videos can go to that channel, and the people who subscribe to the Game News channel can stay here. Now, this is the part that I know is going to be kind of... This is like the, I guess, the part where I feel like it's just a what's catch. So, this new channel, I'm not going to reveal its name. I'm not going to reveal pretty much anything else about it besides it's a tech channel, and I just created it literally today pretty much. But this channel is going to be solely tech videos, but I'm not going to reveal it yet. And the reason I'm not going to reveal it yet is because, A, first off, I want to build up this channel. I want to actually get somewhere with it first, just to know that I'm putting time into this and know that, because I've made channels in the past that I put time into, but then I just gave up on. I want to make sure that this is a channel that I actually will focus on. So I want to build it up, build up like I guess the community, build up my line of videos, and then I'm going to reveal it. So the other reason why I can't, I'm not revealing it now, is because Vizella Productions is now linked to my real life. Whether I like it or not, I revealed my face on it, which I guess could have been avoidable, but I did not realize this outcome when I revealed my face, which was only a few days ago now. But also, there's people in my who I know in real life who I don't want to see my channel yet. I just, it wouldn't, it doesn't feel comfortable for me yet. And I don't want this new channel to be linked to my real life yet. I want it to be separate 100% until I can reveal it. So, let's say a month, two months, a few weeks, whenever I decide that my channel, this new channel is ready, What's going to happen is that if you if you want these tech videos, if you subscribe for the tech videos, what I want you to do is this. I want you to send me an email, business at gmail.com, which is my main account. And that, basically, you're going to put on a list. And when I think my channel, the channel is ready, I'll send out a tweet just to give a little bit of a heads up. And I'm also going to, on the Vizerlo Productions account, I'll be making the tweet. And then I will take all of the email addresses that sent me an email and I will send all of them an email containing a link to the channel and this name. And the reason why I'm not going to announce it on here is because this is going to be a separate channel with Zero Productions, but the two channels are going to still live side by side. They're just going to be separate content. And that's my plan. This plan could fail horrendously. It definitely could, but I feel like this is the best option I could have done. It benefits both sides with very, very little flaws in, in it. Of course, there are some, but I feel like this is the solution that's going to benefit everyone. So if you have your thoughts on this, please let me know in the comments. If you have any anything that you want to let me know, then 
just let me know in the comments. I would really appreciate it because I feel like I owe it to everyone to, I guess, rebuild this community and make it, I guess, more interactive. So that's what I'm going to be working on. And I'm going to be building up the Vizero production channel first for at least a few weeks, at the very least. Then after that, I will start, I will keep making content on Vizero Productions, but I'll also start looking at different content I can make for this new channel. So I hope you did enjoy this video. Again, please leave your thoughts in the comments and see you.